All right, fellers, we're probably going to get working on this thing here, like, pretty soon. My, I didn't think we were going to start tonight, but who knows? We actually might. It's going to be sick. I'm going to have a few more cervezas, and um, we'll see you then. All right, he says he's here. Let's go see. I still got my beer. And, uh, would you just look at that? <clears throat> would you just, just, dude, like... I'm not ready for my close-up yet. Oh, shit. Well, you want me to cut it? Oh, yeah, I'm please. not... Wait. No, what? Hey, dude. Freaking me. elbow bump real quick. Oh, yeah. Yep, there. Okay, well, I heard the beep, so it's okay. What's up, guys? How you guys doing? You guys know... I told you guys. Hopefully, if you pay attention. I don't know if you did. Got a, win got a windshield for the Razor from uh, SuperATV.com. Let's do it. I, I know a lot of people... Don't really care about Super ATV, but let's check it out. Want to? Let's check it out. Let's check it out. So I need a windshield for the Razor. Just I just needed it. And um, let's just pull it right out. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, now it's got film and shit on it still, but yeah, she doesn't look. Actually, it doesn't look too bad at all. It's got a nice, it's got a nice texture on it, and. Um, Okay, well, she is done. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. No, I'm just kidding. So, anyway, this is the windshield. Got a bunch of clamps and stuff in the box as well. But um, we're just gonna go ahead and start it. Let's uh, let's freaking get to it, dudes. Let's do it. We're gonna teach you how to do it. Perfect. Um, okay, so we figured out how these clamps work. Super ATV. He's got these clamps where it's not like bolt-on or anything like that. And um, it's weird. But it works. So here's the windshield. Make it Try to short and sweet. So what you want to do is just make sure it fits, and which we did. And make sure everything lines up before you take off the plastic. And uh, we're just going to go ahead and just rip it off. And uh, it's not, res not scratch resistant. So it is going to be what it is. So you just have to make do with it now i don't think this has any uh plastic on it which maybe it does actually maybe it does dude or maybe i'm just peeling away the oh no it actually does oh wow oh wow okay it surprised me for a second there that is freaking clean like look at that look at it it's so freaking clean, dude. Holy mother of G. That's gonna, oh, 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 okay. I missed a spot there. So anyway, so you wanna take all the plastic off, all that good stuff, and then she's off. Wow. Okay, I have a way different perspective on this thing. It looks good. I like it. So, um, what you gonna do? is uh, we're gonna go ahead and cut it here in a second, but what you do is just run this rubber stripping or weather stripping all the way across the bottom of the windshield. And then when we hit that, we'll just uh, pick it up from there. So um, I'll see you guys here in a second, okay? Okay, okay. All right, so we can cut this rubber out here a little bit. And don't know why it's being so freaking, oh wow, that's a lot of, <gasps> being so bad but we're gonna get her cut and it's gonna be a good time let's, let's just freaking do it okay. let her run dude okay so here we go guys this is it this is the whole windshield we got the whole um, um sealant um cut out the one part we tried to cut out had some metal in it so a little box cutter didn't quite do it so anyways it, it fit good only complaints i have is it does not quite match the molding of the windshield which is not a big deal because you're gonna get wind under here you're gonna go wind up there and you're gonna get wind over here not a big deal i just have a little bit of ocd so those little things are a little bit of a problem but not too bad so uh tyler if you don't if you don't mind yeah. would, you, would you like to hold the camera for me oh, and sure. uh we'll just go ahead now like i said it comes with these little clamps and all you gotta do is what the is that freaking bug? All you gotta do is put the undo the clamp. You're gonna do this for your mom, leave it. She's leaving? 
Oh, that's very seldom hanging outside of this. That's what I was kind of like. Wow, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, guys? Hopefully, okay. Well, that last clip is just funny as hell because it's it's a long story. But I was trying to explain to you guys what's going on here. These are the clamps that they give you. It's a strap on, so it's not like bolt on like my my rhino over here. Where yeah, bolt shit on to the windshield. <laughs> Jesus. And uh, so these straps, which don't make quite sense, but I ended up putting that side on. I think it's right. It is what it is. So <laughs> you're doing dirty. Jesus. I'm, you know what? It's a long story because Tyler, you don't really know what's going on. I'm gonna. Like I said I'm gonna explain it to you, but later on. But it's just, it's just good. It's just a good time. You heard that? Yep. Okay. Uh, so anyways, what you do with the clamp, you just take it, strap. It's new to me too. There's a pre-cut hole. All you do is you take it, put it right, right through the fucking hole. Put it right through the hole, through, through the windshield this way, I think. And, uh, okay, so I figured it out, my bad. So you know what, guys, I had a few beers. So anyway, what you do, like I said, just stick it through the windshield. It's a strap. Strap on! And then um, at the back, you want to go through the back side of the loop and go out. So it's kind of hard to show on camera, but you do that. And uh, once it, <laughs> you want it to go through the head a little bit, then, um... And you just pull her tight, dudes. You just pull her freaking tight and just strap her on in. And that was like an inside joke with me and my pops like five minutes ago. But that's all you do. And look at that. Freaking Leonardo, dude. And that's a, hopefully they don't see this, but that, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Just freaking, just, just look at it. It's an awesome windshield. And it's, Actually, pretty damn, pretty solid, dudes. I mean, I'm gonna probably tighten that one up a little bit, but it's a pretty, it's a good investment. And let me tell you guys, real quick, I wouldn't have done it without Mr. Super ATV, dudes. Super ATV. They only had the, the best windshield that I could find, and it had the best reviews. Some people might not agree, but I do. So far and I don't know where that one shield came from or, or that one. Oh, that one came from art cat but it doesn't matter but I'm happy with this one so far installation was good a couple little minor things I don't like about it but I would buy another one but um it's not really a how-to video it's just kind of like fuck it I'm putting something together and uh, hopefully YouTube doesn't demonetize my shit for saying that but um or cussing who knows but if you stayed this long, check this out. I got a fucking flounder sitting here, dude. Just, <laughs> just fucking <laughs> flapping. All right, I had to get to, I, 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 had to, I had to get Tyler to laugh. It was just that good. Jesus. But if you guys are interested in the build, I got so many more things coming for it. I just got to wash her up. That's a whole other freaking video. But I got a whole bunch of things coming for her. And uh, it's going to be like the the... The most beastly 900S that you have ever seen. And hopefully you guys do enjoy. But um, if that's it, that's, that's the windshield. We got it. And um, hopefully you did enjoy it. If you did, please leave a like rating down below. And as always, take care. Stay tuned. And we'll see you in the next one. Okay?